रोहित ये जो टीम है वो आगे भी जाने ना तू पीछे भी जाने ना तू ऐसा कर रही है जो भी है बस ये ये कपल है ये इनकलकेट करने में कितना टाइम लगा है और उसका क्या फायदा हुआ है जी देखिए हमने इस दिन का जो भी प्रेपरेशन किया है दो साल पहले जो हमने स्टार्ट किया था जब से मैं कैप्टन बना वो ऑब्वियसली पहले टी ट्वेंटी वर्ल्ड कप था उसके बाद चैम्पियनशिप था वर्ल्ड टेस्ट उसके बाद अभी ये था तो तीनों फॉर्मेट के लिए हमारा प्रेपरेशन था प्लेयर्स आइडेंटिफाई करना था कि कौन से प्लेयर्स सही प्लेयर्स हो सकते हैं कौन से फॉर्मेट के लिए तो ये जो हमने किया था प्रोसेस ये दो ढाई साल का प्रोसेस था हमने आइडेंटिफाई किए थे कि ये सारे प्लेयर्स होंगे जो तीनों फॉर्मेट में अलग अलग टाइम पे हिस्सा लेंगे और उनको रोल क्लैरिटी दिया गया था कि रोल ये तुम्हारा रोल होगा ऐसे करके जो बेसिक्स होता है एक कैप्टन और कोच का उस तरीके से हमने सबको आइडेंटिफाई करके उनको बोला था कि ये आपका काम होगा टीम के लिए तो आई थिंक अभी तक यहाँ तक पहुँचने में उस रोल क्लैरिटी का काफ़ी बड़ा अहम हिस्सा है क्योंकि परफॉर्मेंस होना ना होना एक बात है बट अगर एज लॉन्ग एज सारे लड़के जो खेल रहे अगर वो क्लियर है तो काम थोड़ा सा आसान हो जाता है तो हमने काफ़ी कोशिश इस चीज़ पे रखा हुआ था कि क्लियर माइंडसेट से खेलेंगे क्लियर रोल आइडेंटिफाई करेंगे और कौन से लड़के कहाँ पर आके बैटिंग करेंगे कौन से लड़के कहाँ पे बॉल करेंगे कौन सा लड़का स्लिप में खड़ा होगा ये सब चीज़ का हमने प्लानिंग किया था तो अभी तक यहाँ तक सारा कुछ अच्छा रहा है होपफुली कल का दिन भी वैसे ही रहे तो अच्छा होगा रोहित हाउ से टू टेक ऑन नॉट सो डोमिनेंट ऑस्ट्रेलिया बट दस द टैग ऑफ फाइव टाइम चैम्पियंस यू आर के अबाउट इट हाउ इज इट दैट no i mean i i don't agree uh, with not being dominant they won eight out of eight uh, the last eight games that they have played and they played it really well so it's going to be a good contest you know both teams obviously uh, both both teams deserve to be uh, at this stage uh, playing the finals uh, and we do understand the importance of uh, what australia uh, can do uh, you know they are a very Uh, complete side and uh, for us again what is important is to focus on what we want to do as a team and i have said it many a times in the past uh, in this tournament and even now i will say the same thing that uh, we w- don't want to worry about uh, <clears throat> what the opposition is and what kind of you know form they are in and all of that we need to focus on uh, what is important for us uh, what we need to do as a team and as as players as well so a lot of focus and lot of time is given to that thought and we will stick to stick to it right uh, the nation wants to know whether uh, are why are you laughing huh? um, whether the team is calm quiet and composed for the final come to the ground you'll see uh, the players it's obviously an optional training not everyone is here <coughs> because i mean it before the game usually we keep an optional training uh, so that you know the guys can do what they want to do but yeah leading up to uh, every game we've been quite composed quite calm about you know what we want to do uh, because we know uh, how it is outside the environment that we have we know how it is and uh, uh the expectations and the pressure and you know the criticism and everything you know so it's important that we stick to our strength uh, our group uh and what we uh want to do as a team this this is not just now this has been happening since game number 1 uh, that we have tried to maintain that uh you know calmness around the dressing room uh, <clears throat> even on the field uh you know when there is a situation where we've been put under pressure we try to stay calm and just react to that pressure no i wanted to know this because on the eve of the final that is important it's a, it's a different ma- match altogether and you know not many players have uh, played or took part in such a final 
या 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 एब्सोल्युटली राइट बट अभी इनसाइड व्हाट दे फील आई कैन टेल यू बिकॉज़ आई एम नॉट स्पेंडिंग 24 आर्स विद देम सो आई डोंट नो हाउ ईच इंडिविजुअल विल बी फीलिंग बट व्हेन दे आर अराउंड द ग्रुप अराउंड आर मीटिंग्स अराउंड आर ट्रेनिंग्स एवरीबॉडी सीम्स टू बी क्वाइट रिलैक्स्ड एंड काम लाइक आई सेड इन द लास्ट PC as well. I was asked about dealing with pressure. I said, being an Indian cricketer, you have to deal with pressure. There is no doubt about it. So that's that's given, and it's there. It's going to be constant. Uh, today we are playing. Tomorrow someone else will play. Day after someone else will play. So they have to deal with these kind of pressure, criticism, and everything. Accolades as well. I'm not just saying criticism. you guys have uh, praised a lot of players as well so uh, so everything is included you have to deal with it as a elite sportsman you have to deal with all these kind of things but yeah looking uh, rohit uh, one minute please uh, rohit uh, is it what okay. yeah yeah uh, seamless performance 54 wickets between 3 and 31 by spinners is it the best you have seen as a pl player and captain the perform as a professional group of bowlers glimpses of which were seen in colombo during the asia cup yeah i i can say that i mean the bowlers have actually done a great job for us in this tournament uh you know when we started off uh, we were we were chasing in the first four or five games and to restrict teams below 300 on you know indian conditions was a great effort uh so it's not been easy uh, it, when containing batsmen restricting the opposition is not an easy job but our seamers and the spinners did that perfectly uh and then again when we the second half of the tournament where we had to defend scores we've defended quite clinically as well so yeah i can say that you know they've been very professional uh they they know what is expected out of them um uh, you know all the three seamers that have played in the second half uh shami siraj bumrah they know exactly what is expected and they try and yeah yaar yeah, phone band rakho yaar so you know they know exactly what is expected and uh how they want to go about doing that stuff and the same for the spinners as well the spinners have come in uh where you know we wanted to take wickets in the middle overs and they've done that uh, so i i all i can say is they've been quite professional about you know doing their job and getting the job done for the team rohit uh, rohit aapne kaha ki uh, players uh, ke bare mein to aap uh, itna nahi bata sakte ki unke man mein kya soch raha hai but bahar jo hai stadium ke bahar nare lag rahe hain ki jeetega to india hi uh, aapke liye personally emotionally uh, ya fir un khiladiyon ke sath jinke sath aapne ek arsa bitaya hai Uh, आप कैसे देखते हैं इस दिन को क्योंकि अक्सर ये कहा जाता है कि ये वर्ल्ड कप फाइनल है इससे बड़ा कुछ हो नहीं सकता आपके लिए काफ़ी वक्त हो गया है क्रिकेट खेलते हुए भी तो आप और आपके इर्द गिर्द जो वो खिलाड़ी हैं जिनके साथ आपने वक्त बिताया इमोशनली आप लोगों के लिए कैसे है नहीं देखिए इमोशनली बहुत बड़ी बहुत बड़ी चीज़ है बहुत बड़ा ओकेजन है विदाउट अ डाउट क्योंकि आप जो भी मेहनत और जो भी सपने देखते हो वो इस चीज़ के लिए देखते हो और आज वो दिन आज नहीं कल वो दिन हमारे सामने होगा बट देखिए प्रोफेशनल एथलीट्स का यही सबसे बड़ा चैलेंज होता है कि आप ये सब चीज़ को साइड में रखकर अपने काम पर कैसे ध्यान दे सकते हो तो आ, मेरे साथ साथ जितने भी और दस खिलाड़ी जो ग्यार खेलेंगे कल ग्राउंड के अंदर उनका उनका भी फोकस अपना जो उनका जो काम होगा करने के लिए टीम के लिए उस चीज़ पर ज़्यादा होगा राधा देन थिंकिंग अबाउट कि यू नो ये मेरे लाइफ का सबसे बड़ा मोमेंट है ऑफकोर्स है देर इज़ नो डाउट वो बैक ऑफ द माइंड बिल्कुल है ही वो आप उस चीज़ से आप छुप नहीं सकते हो बट ऐसे सिचुएशन में काम रहना बहुत ज़रूरी है क्योंकि अगर आप काम हो कंपोज हो तो आपका जो रोल है टीम के लिए वो आप अच्छे तरीके से निभा सकते हो प्रेशर सिचुएशन में आप अच्छे डिसीजन ले सकते हो अगर आप बैटिंग कर रहे हो तो कौन से शॉट्स खेलने इस टाइम पर कौन से शॉट्स नहीं खेलने बॉलर्स अगर बॉल डाल रहे हैं प्रेशर में तो क्या एग्जीक्यूट करना है टीम के लिए कौन से बैट्समैन का स्ट्रेंथ कहाँ पर है कहाँ नहीं डालना चाहिए तो ये सब चीज़ एग्जीक्यूट करने के लिए आपको शांत और काम रहना बहुत ज़रूरी है तो आई थिंक लड़कों का फोकस इस चीज़ पर ज़्यादा होगा एंड देन ओकेजन तो है जैसे मैंने बताया ओकेजन बहुत बड़ा है 
ऐसे ओकेजन्स आपको हर बार नहीं मिलते फाइनल खेलने का मौका आपको हर हर बार नहीं मिलता है और मेरे लिए ये सबसे बड़ा इवेंट है वर्ल्ड कप फिफ्टी ओवर बचपन से हम मैं तो फिफ्टी ओवर वर्ल्ड कप देख बड़ा हुआ हूँ तो मेरे लिए ये सबसे बड़ा मोमेंट है बट मुझे पता है कि टीम को जो टीम को मेरी ज़रूरत जहाँ पर है उस चीज़ पर मेरे को ध्यान देना है और बाकी जो भी चीज़ है उसको थोड़ा सा थोड़ी देर के लिए मैं साइड में रखना चाहूँगा रोहित यू हैव बिन फिनोमिनल एज ए बैट्समैन एज वेल एज ए कैप्टन जस्ट वॉन्ट टू नो वॉट हैज़ बिन द रोल ऑफ द कोच राहुल राविड हुज लार्जली स्टेड इन द बैकग्राउंड वेरी अंडर स्टेटेड Uh, what has been his role in the leadership no his role has been absolutely massive uh, in terms of uh, you know getting that clarity which i keep talking about uh, there's one thing for me to think about and the other thing for coach to not agree to certain things um, clearly you know uh, looking at uh, you know how rahul bhai himself has played his cricket uh, you know and how i am playing these days obviously it's quite contrasting uh for him to agree and give me that freedom and liberty to go and play like that So, check you know good run up until that semi final and we lost and how he reacted to certain situations uh in and informing the players so from the players yeah inform the players about you know this is what we are looking at and all of that you know says a lot about him as as well and uh, obviously you know what he has done for indian cricket is massive and he also uh you know feels that he wants to be part of this big occasion uh, and it's it's for us to do it for him thank you rohit uh, i just want to know uh, while talking about players and uh, helping them and them knowing there's clarity of roles etc can you talk a little bit i know it's oft repeated but about shami and how did you kind of man handle him in trying to overcome the issues that he was having uh, issues uh, um, maybe maybe it was injury or maybe it no no i mean yeah see like for him it was so it, it was tough for him to not play the initial part of the world cup looking at him being one of the senior bowler for us but you know he was there for the team uh, he was there to help siraj he was there to help bumrah in whatever ways he could uh and that shows the quality of him uh you know being the team man that he is uh and it was very clear we had a chat with him about you know why he missed out and everything uh and then obviously on the sidelines he was working on his bowling um uh, and then i mean the results are there for everyone to see how he has come back from that that, that shows you know the kind of mental space that Shami was uh, before the World Cup and and even now, uh, it's not easy not being part of the team and then come come out and you know do the job that in the way that he has done for us uh, says a lot about him uh, you know but like you, you know when you're playing a team sport people do understand why X Y Z have to miss out uh, on certain occasions uh, because there's lot that goes into uh, getting your player uh, getting your eleven right. Uh, it, that depends everything you, you know on your conditions uh, the opposition and the balance that you want to create uh, it was just that and then once the opportunity opened up for him he was uh, he was uh, he was right there uh, and that we we all can see with his performance rohit kal humne ashwin ko 
बैटिंग और बॉलिंग करते हुए देखा है और देखा गया कि अभी पिछले मैचों में स्पिनर्स ने बहुत अच्छा काम किया है तो क्या कल तीन स्पिनर्स के साथ हम उतरने का कोई प्लानिंग बना रहे नहीं देखिए अब अभी ऐसा कुछ हमने डिसाइड नहीं किया है बट पंद्रह के पंद्रह लोग में से कोई भी खेल सकता है अपॉर्चुनिटी सबके लिए है आ, हम अच्छी तरीके से विकेट को असेस करेंगे आ, आज और कल भी आकर देखेंगे मैच के जस्ट पहले और डिसाइड करेंगे हम हमारे बारह या तेरह तो फिक्स है कि कौन उसमें से खेलेगा बट हमें जस्ट देखना होगा कि आ, विकेट कल कैसे दिख रहा है और क्या है हमारी स्ट्रेंथ क्या है उनकी वीकनेस क्या हो सकती है तो ये सब चीज़ देखना पड़ता है आ, अभी हमने आ, ऐसा कोई डिसीजन लिया नहीं है कि हमारी 11 क्या होगी बट सारे के सारे लड़के मैं चाहता हूँ कि अवेलेबल रहे फिर देन कल डिसाइड करेंगे कि किसको खिलाना है रोहित ऑल द बेस्ट कल के लिए सबकी तरफ से थैंक यू साथ में ऑस्ट्रेलियन कैप्टन ने कहा कि उनके पास एडवांटेज ये है कि 2015 वर्ल्ड कप जीते हुए उनके पास छः से सात खिलाड़ी इस समय हैं इस टीम में क्या वाकई ये एडवांटेज है नहीं देखिए मेरे मेरे नज़र में तो ऐसा एडवांटेज नहीं हो सकता बिकॉज आई कैन अंडरस्टैंड कि कौन से एंगल से वो बोल रहे हैं क्योंकि एक्सपीरियंस प्लेयर्स है उस फाइनल का एक्सपीरियंस उन्होंने वो फाइनल खेलने का एक्सपीरियंस है उन प्लेयर्स को बट आई थिंक जब आप ऐसा टूर्नामेंट खेलते हो और अभी हम आठ साल बाद की बात कर रहे हैं यू नो आई थिंक प्लेयर्स का करंट फॉर्म करंट स्टेट ऑफ माइंड सब उस उससे ज़्यादा जा, इम्पोर्टेंट होता है uh, हमारे टीम में भी है लड़कों ने काफ़ी फाइनल्स खेला है वर्ल्ड कप फाइनल नहीं खेला है बट काफ़ी फाइनल्स खेला हुआ है uh, दो लड़के हैं जिन्होंने 2011 में वर्ल्ड कप फाइनल खेला था अश्विन शायद नहीं खेले थे बट विराट खेले थे बट uh, जहाँ तक बात है uh, ऐसे फाइनल्स की आई uh, थिंक काफ़ी लड़के हैं टीम में जिन्होंने जैसे मैंने बताया कि फाइनल्स खेले हुए प्रेशर सिचुएशन को कैसे हैंडल करना है उन्हें मालूम है तो आई डोंट थिंक ऐसा कोई एक्स्ट्रा एडवांटेज होगा आई मीन वो उनकी सोच है हमारी सोच थोड़ी अलग है हम बस जिस तरीके से हम अपना क्रिकेट अब तक खेलते आ रहे हमें वैसे ही कंटिन्यू करना है और फिर देखते कहाँ क्या होता है Yeah. The weather conditions are totally different. Yeah. The temperatures are different. I, I ask comments the same thing in the morning. What do you think will be the different, and how do you think is wicket uh, uh, in in present condition? We were talking about 35 days ago, and now <coughs> is the same wicket. What is the difference in that? Have you noticed anything, or what do you think about the wicket and the weather conditions? Yeah, I mean that wicket. Uh, there was no grass on it. this wicket has some grass on it uh, uh you know that wicket looked a lot more drier than this one i don't know again maybe uh, you know we we still i still haven't looked today uh, how the wicket is but from my understanding obviously it's it's slightly it's going to be on the slower side uh, but again tomorrow we have to come and assess what it is like it's not going to change too much but it's always nice to uh you know see the pitch on the day of the game and then assess what you want to do uh, that is something that we've uh, maintained for a long period of time and that is something that we have done before as well so it's not something new for us to come and assess the pitch on the day of the game uh, and the players are aware of it as well um but in terms of you know the conditions changing yes the temperatures have do- dropped a little bit i don't know how much of a do factor there will be because you know against that pakistan game when we trained before the game there were a lot of dew but there was no dew during the game and even uh, you know few days back at wankhede we were training there were a lot of dew on the game day there wasn't much so I, that's why i keep saying the toss is not going to be a factor uh, you got to play well to win the game regardless of you know the conditions and uh the temperatures uh, you got to play well uh, you got to play good cricket uh, absorb the pressure whenever the uh, the pressure has been put on you uh so yeah i think that's that's where it boils down to you got to just understand what is expected out of you at that point in time uh, rohit uh, 20 saal pehle india aur australia ka final hua tha 
2003 में तो कुछ यादें उस मैच की हैं कभी सोचा था कि भाई बीस साल बाद आपको मौका मिलेगा अगेंस्ट ऑस्ट्रेलिया क्योंकि उतने दिन बात खेल रही है ये और उस ऑस्ट्रेलियन टीम का एक और हुआ करता था कि भाई मैच में कोई भी उतरने से पहले उनको लगता था इस टीम को हरा नहीं सकते थे अभी तक जिस तरह से ये इंडियन टीम खेली आपको लगता है सिमिलर काइंड ऑफ और है इवन विदाउट द वर्ल्ड कप ट्रॉफी नहीं देखिए मैं नहीं वो उस चीज़ पे बिलीव करता हूँ और और वो सब चीज़ पे ये मैंने जैसे बताया कि आपको उस दिन पे अच्छा अच्छे तरीके से ग्राउंड पे आना है और अच्छा क्रिकेट खेलना है आ, मैं ये चीज़ में बिलीव नहीं करता हूँ कि पिछले दस मैच में हमने क्या किया ऑफ़ कोर्स कॉन्फिडेंस लेना बहुत ज़रूरी है ऐसे मैचेस में दस मैचेस हमने अच्छे तरीके से खेला है बट अगेन आपने अगर कल गलतियाँ की तो वो दस मैचेस में आपने जितना भी अच्छा काम किया है वो पूरा वेस्ट होने का चांसेस है तो आई थिंक अपने आप को बैलेंस रखना अपने आप को काम रखना ज़्यादा आगे पीछे का सोचना नहीं चाहिए प्रेजेंट का सोचो और अपना गेम खेलो जो मंत्रा हमने फॉलो किया अभी तक वो यही है पिछले गेम को हम इस गेम में नहीं लेके आए या पास्ट में क्या हुआ है या फ्यूचर में क्या होने वाला है वो सब चीज़ के बारे में हमने ज़्यादा सोचा नहीं हमने बस यही सोचा है कि नेक्स्ट अपोजिशन कौन है उनके सामने हमको कैसा क्रिकेट खेलना है और हमारी स्ट्रेंथ क्या है उनकी स्ट्रेंथ क्या है कैसे उनके वीकनेस को एक्सप्लोर किया जाए और कैसे हमारे स्ट्रेंथ को बढ़ावा दिया जाए ये सब चीज़ पर ज़्यादा फोकस रहता है ये नहीं कि बीस साल पहले क्या हुआ है और आई डोंट थिंक उस ऐसे चीज़ों में सोचकर हम ज़्यादा वो नहीं करना चाहते प्रेजेंट चीज़ के बारे में सोचकर और अच्छे तरीके से प्रिपेयर करना चाहते रोहित भाई आपने एक आईसीसी टूर्नामेंट का फाइनल खेला 2007 में टी ट्वेंटी वर्ल्ड कप था जब एमएस धोनी कैप्टन थे आप बड़े यंग थे उस समय उन्होंने भी मैच से पहले या फाइनल से पहले कुछ मैसेज दिया होगा अब आप कैप्टन हैं वर्ल्ड कप का फाइनल है आप जब टीम हडल होगा या टीम मीटिंग होगी आपका क्या मंत्रा क्या मैसेज प्लेयर्स के साथ कुछ है? चेंजेस नहीं होंगे जो जिस तरीके से मैंने अभी बताया जिस ज, जैसे हम खेलते आए उसी तरीके से खेल खेलना पसंद करेंगे कोई अलग मैसेज देने की ज़रूरत है नहीं आ, 2007 में मुझे नहीं लगता है कि एम ने कोई अलग मैसेज दिया था जिस तरीके से हमने स्टार्ट किया था उसी तरीके से हमने फाइनल भी खेला हाँ ऑफकोर्स आप कैप्टनसी स्पीच तो होती होगी नहीं ऐसा कुछ ऐसा कुछ नहीं होता है जो हम नॉर्मल डिस्कशन जो करते हैं गेम के दौरान गेम के पहले वो नॉर्मल डिस्कशंस होते रहते उसके अलावा कोई उसके अलावा कोई और चीज़ों के बारे में बात नहीं होती है Uh, Rohit, uh, this World Cup you have been ultra aggressive. So, what is the philosophy behind it? Is it because the, you have solid batsmen uh, to follow, or you know this is the, you have always been attacking batsmen, but particularly in this World Cup you have been ultra aggressive. Anything you can say about that approach? No, uh, look honestly, before the start of the World Cup, I do wanted to play in a certain manner. Uh, I had no idea that it is going to come off, or what it is, what if it doesn't come off. I had plans for both. If it comes off, what I'm going to do in the next game. If it doesn't come off, what I'm going to do in the next game. Um, but like, see, for me, what is important is because I start the innings. You know, there is a bit of freedom there uh, for me to go and express myself. Uh, but you must have seen in that game against England where I had to. Change my game a little bit uh, once we lost a uh, few wickets, uh, and then I had to change my game a little bit. I'm prepared to do that as well. Uh, that is what the experienced player needs to do. Uh, you can't just think that you have to play one way. Uh, you have to adapt and uh, uh, adapt quickly, and knowing the situations uh, that are there in front of you. So I'm prepared to do, uh, you know, whatever role I feel at that point is right for the team. So you know, I've prepared my. game prepared my tactics around that so i'm pretty clear in what i want to do uh, as a batsman uh, you know and you know when you play on good pitches you sometimes you get that feeling that it's a good pitch you can take on the bowlers you know sometimes if you see the ball is just uh, you know nipping around a little bit you need to try and understand what are your uh, thoughts then uh, so i'm prepared to you know take all of this thought uh, into into the game uh, and then go about it Hey Rohit, uh, we started this tournament. A lot of us were here in Chennai when the tournament began. It was your press conference before taking on Australia. It was the tournament opener, and there was the question of unfinished business. And 
Um, a lot of us remember that one line you said, it was very nonchalant, and you said it will be nice to win a World Cup. Um, is that an attitude that has helped in your campaign, not the aggressive, we want to do this, we want to get that? Has that understated, quiet sort of a yeah. uh, presence helped you in your campaign so far? And uh, coming a full circle from that point to here, what would you say? Yeah, no, exactly. Like you said, spot on, because that's what I believe in, uh, you know, just going there and you know, keeping it nice and easy, calm. Uh, like I said, when you asked me that question, I said, yeah, it'll be nice to win the World Cup. So, I, in, in the same tone, I want to say it now again, the same thing. It'll be nice to do it uh, uh, because we've worked really hard for it. But again, we don't want to get too uh, excited about it or you don't want to feel too much pressure about it. You know, a nice balanced uh, atmosphere, a ni nice balanced thinking uh, at this stage will be really nice. And it's just not from me, you can, I can sense that from every other player as well in the, in the changing room, that, you know, there's a laugh going around uh, in the changing room. Uh, there's a bit of tensed faces as well. I'm not going to uh, hide that, but that's, that's normal. That's, that, that is what, you know, that is what, that is why this sport is so exciting because you, you see all different kind of emotions. Uh, but obviously when it's the game time, you know, guys are very well, aware of what needs to be done now. Uh, we, we don't need to tell them specifically that, okay, now put your game face on, it's time to get the job done and all of that. Guys are quite experienced. Uh, not many have played the finals, but, you know, they've, like I said, playing for India is as good as playing any World Cup game because there's so much pressure, there's so much expectation. Always uh, at the airport, you're going here and there, World Cup jeetna hai, ye karna hai, run banana hai, doso banana hai, paach wicket lena hai, so that that happens. So it is in your ears all the time. I, I've seen guys starting started to wear headphones now so that they can keep the noise out. Uh, but it's nice, you know. We have enjoyed our journey thoroughly till now. Uh, so yeah, just one final push now. Hi, Rohit. This has been an interesting journey for you yourself. Twelve years back at home, you were not a part of the team, but today you are leading this side. Talk to us about your journey and how does it feel today? Look, I mean, I don't want to go back there. It was a very emotional period. Uh, I think I'm sure everyone knows about it. It was a very hard time. But again, now I'm very happy that I'm at this stage where, you know, I'm, I'm leading the team into the final. I never thought it will happen. But, you know, things do happen if you, uh, if you wish for it. Uh, and if you dream big, all these things happen. Um, so, yeah, I, I'll, I'll just, I'm just very happy to be here. But I know uh, the importance of tomorrow. Uh, so I just want to keep it nice and relaxed and calm and not get too emotional thinking about what happened in 2011 or what can happen tomorrow. I just want to create the same environment that I created for myself when we started this World Cup. Uh, we were all in great space. We are, in, we are all in great space now. So I just want to maintain that. Uh, like I said, don't want to go too up. Don't want to go too low, just nice and balanced. Rohit, when we played the first match when we played against Australia, so what is the mind that you can go with the final match with six ballers, or with three spinners, two fast ballers? What do you think of that? Ashwin, we have seen that Australia is always a lot of trouble. Look, I have told you that all the options are available. I don't want to say anything about it right now. क्या करने वाले हम और क्या नहीं करने वाले हम बट देखिए सारे प्लेयर्स को पता है ये चीज हमने स्टार्ट ऑफ द टूर्नामेंट ही हमने बात किया था बात किया था कि कोई भी प्लेयर कभी भी खेल सकता है तो ऐसा प्लेयर के दिमाग में नहीं है कि मेरा तो टूर्नामेंट हो गया मैं रिलैक्स करता हूँ ऐसा ऐसा कोई फीलिंग नहीं है क्योंकि सबको पता है कि कभी भी खेलने का मौका आ सकता है जैसे आपने देखा कि एक इंजरी हो गई उसके बाद दो लड़कों को मौका मिल गया so guys have taken that job very, uh, guys have done that job perfectly, Shami or Surya. Surya ko, although he didn't get a chance to get a lot of batting, uh, but Shami has, you know, uh, come to a good way. He was very easy to relax his mind, that no, it's done, I think I won't play it. But, you know, all cricketers are quite professional, everyone knows that you know, all cricketers are quite professional, everyone knows that this is a World Cup. ये हर साल नहीं होता है, 
तो रेडी रहना मेंटली प्रिपेयर करना मेंटली ये सब बहुत ज़रूरी है तो आई थिंक पंद्रह के पंद्रह लोग को मैं अवेलेबल रखूँगा कल के लिए और फिर देखते हैं कि कौन किसको खिलाए Um, uh, Rohit, you've spoken this year a few times about wanting to create a brand of cricket for your team uh, in other formats, but especially one-day cricket. So, just the way you guys have played uh, in the last ten matches, do you think you created that brand and set the standard just internationally going forward, regardless of what happens tomorrow? Or in your head, are you going, "Arey brand win, ठीक है, match जीतना ही है कल"? तो नहीं वो brand win ज़रूरी है क्योंकि अगर कुछ decide किया है तो we have to Go and implement that, uh, and I thought, you know, guys have implemented that. You can see uh, with the scores that we have put up on the board, uh, the way we've gone about our chases. Uh, obviously, you know, all seven cannot just go and play uh, widely and play that brand of cricket. Obviously, the roles have given to certain individuals as to what their roles are for this team and what can benefit the team, um, and I. I think 99.9 percent we played that brand of cricket. One percent, that point one I have taken out because you cannot always be perfect. That's why I have just taken out that one point one. But I am very pleased with the messaging that myself and Rahul Bai has given to the boys, and you know, boys have responded to that pretty pretty well, uh, without worrying about their place in the team, without worrying about. The scores that they get, uh, you know, and without even worrying about what happens outside, that is the most important part. Uh, because you know that 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 environment that we've created uh, is 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 a very special one, and we want to maintain that environment, uh, you know, as long as possible, uh, and not get faced by what what happens outside or what people talk or you know, if if the score doesn't come from individuals. I don't want them to change the thought process that they were in before the start of the tournament. So, all those things are very clear with everyone. And I thought in this entire ten games that we played, we were quite uh, straightforward with that thought. Rohit, uh, while talking when. Uh, talking about playing against Australia, you guys are quite familiar with playing against Australia. You have already played two ODI series against them in this year. So, just wanted to know, does this familiarity at all help in a big occasion like this? No, it does help. It. Do I mean, see, look, those two ODIs are not going to matter too much because all their players play with with you all the time in IPL teams and all that. So, you know the mental side of, you know, X Y Z player, what they think and how they go about playing each game. And likewise, they also know about what we do. Uh, so, I mean, I I, I don't think that uh, unknown territory is a situation these days because you're quite familiar with, uh, you know, what each individual is all about and how they want to prepare themselves and what the mindset they will have while playing the World Cup final. We are quite aware of, you know, how their each individual is going to approach, and probably it's the same for them as well. They will know what. We are going to do so. It's just uh, going to be a battle between bat and ball tomorrow, more than uh, you know, knowing each other as such. 